The celebration is to honor volunteers and partners in education and all kinds of people who dedicate their time to our schools. And this year we're actually involving the students in the planning process. branching out because the partnerships and the students are working together in a collaborative effort. The catering class was working with some chefs um, making a dish. The interior design people were working with like design company and people who are working on the film itself which is me and my peers we worked with the company JPix. We did do a lot of the camera work and we were documenting, doing a lot of b-roll, doing interviews. And we constructed the clips we had to make the film that we're presenting. All for the April 27, 2017 community celebration. We're here at Commune to learn about the locally grown food. Going out to the farm and seeing how Chef Kevin makes his menu off of what's in season and makes it healthier for the community and makes it fresher and cheaper and more effective. People from Commune are coming over and teaching us all about the vegetables that we have to be using and all the ingredients that they have put together. Well, we were contacted and Commune wanted to partner with the hospitality and catering class. Um, as being the teacher, I am more of the facilitator that brought my kids in touch with Commune and gave them the opportunity to experience um, a different type of food preparation, different thought and menu planning, um, and luckily they've been able to work with us and come out and help expand their knowledge of local ingredients and how they can be utilized. Knowing what's going into your body is the easiest way to protect yourself. So little nowadays do we tend to care about what's happening around us, um, most importantly to our earth. Sustainability essentially just means that we'll have the same things for our kids and our kids' kids, and uh, that's 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 truly important to me. We hope to come up with something that's locally grown and natural, and just something that everyone enjoys. With the catering class in particular, what's interesting is normally they're just making food, but now this is bringing into the conversation where does that food actually come from? So what is it that the, the community and um, society as a whole does to, to get food to the plate? Um, so really taking that uh, to the next level and really talking about where food actually comes from is um, really a neat uh, layer to this. Uh, you could see it in the kids, you know, normally they're sitting in the classroom, but they were out today and they were here in the actual environment that's right down the street from their school, learning what people in their community and, and really special here, uh, graduates of their own high school are now doing. Um, it's pretty cool. Uh, I was here working with a class that's designing the maps for the community celebration program and giving them some feedback about that. Um, you know, it's a cycle of, of the people who kind of come through the schools and uh, the educators and the administrators who all kind of make that happen. Um, you know, that community is, is incredibly important and, and giving kids a, a key role in that is, uh, is, is imperative. I mean, those are all real things that people do in, in, their real, in the real world and in their own businesses. And so getting exposure to those different parts of the process and finding out which parts you really like doing is, is key. It's the real world, you know, I mean, they're putting on a major scale event of, and bringing together all the different parts and pieces you need to bring something like that to life. It's, it's about as real world, I think, of an exposure as they could get.